Hello everyone. In this video, we will discuss what is the difference between two different types of import statement. The first is import then module name, which we generally use in our coding. Second, from module name import object. So we will see what is the difference between these two. First, we will see theoretically, then we will see it practically. So the first difference is import module is used to import the whole module. Module is a .py file. When you use import module, it will import everything in this .py file or module into your code. If you are doing import into your code, this is y.py, if you are doing import y, then everything what is there in this y.py will go to x.py. So this is import module. You can import n number of module by putting all those modules by separating them using commas. So the second thing, consider there are different functions. These are called object of .py file. So if you want to import just only function one, then you will use this type of statement where we will import only object. You can import n number of object by separating them using commas. Or if you want, you can import only single object. So if I want only function one, I will write from y import function one inside this x.py. So this will import, this line will import only function one. Now if you want to import all the objects of y.py inside x.py, you will write from module import star. This will import all the objects of .py, y.py into x.py. Now you will ask what then what is the difference between these two lines? This and this line is doing same thing. This is importing, these two are importing the whole module. Then what is the difference? So here is the difference. When I use import module name, then it will create a new name space. What is a name space? We have discussed in earlier video. You can watch that video to know what is name space. So when we do import module name, then this will create a new name space. If I want to access any object of this module, I will use module name, then dot operator, then object name. But in case of this, the Python do not create new namespace. So I can access any object directly without using dot operator. You can access it directly. Now let us see what are these differences. So consider I am having one module math and I have created another module my module dot py. If I import math in my module all the function and constants will import into my module. This line will create a new namespace that we have discussed earlier. So when I write this line and this line will execute, what will happen? This will create a new namespace inside my mymodule.py which has name math and it will have sqrt, sign, cause and all the constants and objects. So whenever if I want to access it, Inside my 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 module dot py, I have to use math dot sqrt. That means this line has created a new namespace for math. So I have to access it using math dot sqrt. But now consider this second way. If I import math module using from math import any object name or I can use 
from math import star in both the cases no new namespace will be created and if i want to access math objects i can use directly i do not need to write math dot i can access it directly that means these way have not created any new namespace inside my my module dot py so these are the differences between these two let us see it practically as you can see i have one module my module i have created one variable my variable and a function my function let us go to python shell and we will import this module so we have imported this module now we will use one function that is a built in function of python that returns all the objects that is inside any module you can see there are different built in objects or variables and my objects are also there in this list that means my module is having all these objects now let us try to import math inside this my module dot py and let us see what happens we have saved this file and we will open python shell again so we have opened python shell we will import my module again and see the objects using directory you can see now i am having three objects match my function and my variable match is now a part of my module that means i can access match module objects inside my my module consider if i want to print value of pi i can print this using math.py let us save this and we will go to and we will execute my uh, this py file and see what is the output see it has returned the value of pi that means i can access pi using math.py now if i want to remove this and i want to access pi directly let us see what happens in this case the name pi is not defined that means pi is not there in my module so we will import my module what this line does whenever you do any import to any module or in command prompt what it will do it will execute your code it will execute all the dot py file if there is any calculation or any print statement it will run so if i so if i import my module in this python shell then it will run the my module so it is giving the same error because pi is not there if i see my module directly because it is giving the error that is why it is not importing comment this and we will try to see will open the shell again and try to import my module 
we will see the directory. You can see there is math, but there is no pi. That means we cannot access pi directly from math mod from my module. That is why this line was giving the error. I can access it using math dot. If I want to access it directly, for this purpose, I have to make pi available within the namespace of my module. For doing this, what I need to do, I have to use different form of import. So I will use from math import pi or I can use I can use different I can import different objects of math module or I can use a star let us import only pi and sqrt and we will open our python cell again in this case previous case there was math and my function and my variable because I had my variable and my function and math. Now we have imported it again and let us try to open python cell again and we will import our my module. We will comment it so that it will not execute and will not print at the time of at the time when I import the module so I have imported the module now check the DIR so you can see I have my function and my variable with that I do not have math now I have pi and sqrt that means pi and sqrt are are now the now within the namespace of my module so this is the namespace of my module that means all the names which are directly accessible from my module so pi and sqrt are within my namespace of my module so i can access it directly so if i want to print pi directly i can print it let us run it and you can see now it is printing in this case it is not giving the error fine if I want to do this now this line should give me error now because math is now math is not the part of my module namespace because I am using different form of import now so let us run this You can see now math is not defined because we are not using import math now. We are using from math import pi and sqrt. Fine. Now let us import all the objects from the math. So we will do star. And now we will run this. We will go to python cell. We will comment this. Then we will go to python cell and try to import this module again so what we have done we have commented this and we are importing all the objects by using star this will import all the math objects math module objects inside my module now let us run this uh, sorry let us go to the python cell and import my module so i have imported my module now see the namespace objects of my module as you can see 
I had only my function and variable, my variable inside my module. My variable and my function. And all the other functions and objects are coming from math module. So you can see this is the name space, new name space of my module. I can access these. I can access these without any prefix or module name and dot operator. I hope you have got the difference between from import from module import and import module. If you have any doubt, you can ask me in comments. Thank you.